Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love and thank you so much for joining me here for another Oracle reading. Today I'm using this fabulous deck by the one and only Doreen Virtue. So let's get shuffling, see what comes up today. We're gonna to be telling our angels to give us some guidance for 2017 because it is going to be a magical year. Not only because of the numerology when you add up um, 2017, so 2017, add it together to form one single digit and it is one. One signifies the start of a new beginning, a new chapter, and the end of a nine year slog. It's amazing to think back to what actually happened in the past nine years because that's when I first became a primary school teacher, I realized I didn't agree with the education system. I started becoming a little bit of a hippie. More so being in tune with who I am and, whoa, one card just fell out. Oh, great card, universe. What do you desire? How spectacular is the pictures in this card? Oh, I love the color. Love, love, love the color. All right, let me read for you. It says, you now have the opportunity to write the script according to your heart's true desires. Once you clearly decide upon your true desires and know that you're ready and deserving of them, you'll rush into a life as if it's by magic. Oh my God. When I think about this, it's kind of, well, it's perfect for this year and the new start to a nine year series. I love the color in this. To me, it's creativity. Creativity everywhere. It's just like, I just, well, maybe that's come to mind because I just recently read the book, Big Magic by the best-selling author, Elizabeth Gilbert from Eat, Pray, Love. And she's all about un um, uh, harnessing your creativity so it's not detrimental to your own health and well-being and, I'm gonna make a video about that because it is such a good book. I actually didn't read it, I listened to it on audiobook because I was a little bit too lazy, but it's, audiobook's like my new favorite thing when I'm driving. And, oh, what, oh, here it is. Oh, here we go. Let me just read this for you. I'm only new to the whole Oracle reading stuff, so I don't know all of the cards off by heart, so I just read. Anyway, it's kind of fun. It says, this card comes to you because you've been waiting for external signs of what you should do next. The angels say that the answer comes from inside of you. Oh my God. You must decide what you want before anything can change. Carve out time to meditate upon your hearts, your true heart's desires and know that you deserve the best and all as we all do. T -t Today, Junior. Additional meanings. Use affirmations and positive visualizations to manifest your desires. Clarify your desires, release any guilt of fear regarding what you have asked for. Oh my God, ah, this is amazing. I just posted a video about how to release um, physical and emotional blockages. So if you haven't watched that, check that out. Also, you need to watch my video, my self-love practices, how to feel beautiful. Oh my God, I love this. This is a very, very beautiful card. Oh my God. Okay. I just see creativity. That's what I see. This is a general reading, by the way. So just take what feels right for you. All right. Universe, we would like some more information about our desires and listening to our intuition and being in alignment with our true authentic self. Oh my God, this reading is so exciting. I love this. I tried to record this video like four times, but for some reason it never worked. And then my camera would always, the memory card would say it would always be full. And I was like, where did that five gig of data go? Because I have no idea. Anyway, this is flowing so much better this time. And obviously, I do you believe this card? All right, um, I'll stop yappering on. We're already at four minutes. I just saw another numerology, 444. I've been seeing quite a lot of that recently. Like my phone battery, I swear, is only like 99%, 88%, 77%, 44%, 22%. 
and it dies at 22% because I need a new phone. All right, oop. Oh my God. <laughs> Shower of abundance. This card is actually on my um, vision board. So it says to heal your financial situation, First, give us your worries concerning money. We will guide you in order to show you how to create and accept abundance. As we work together, your financial situation will heal as fast as you'll allow. Ooh, so maybe what your heart desires is actually, you know, it's maybe being blocked by money. Maybe you wanted to get a personal trainer, but you didn't have the money or maybe you wanted to start this amazing creative project, but you didn't have the funds to build the app that you wanted. Holy moly. All right, let's find out more about the shower of abundance. Okay, this card is a sign that your prayers about finances have been heard and answered. The more you can listen to, follow, listen to and follow your gut, feelings right here, the quicker you experience improvements to your financial situation. Uh, additional meanings. Uh, the coins that you're finding lately are loving signs from your angels and departed loved ones. An unexpected financial windfall is coming to you. Give any financial fears to your angels. Follow any guidance you receive as it could be the an answer and answered prayers about your finances. Abundance can take many forms, including having more time, opportunities, or clear ideas. What? So that can be, oh, that's so brilliant. I love Oracle readings. Okay, let's have another card just to clarify a little bit more about this creative project or this new venture that you're taking but has been blocked by the abundance factor. So maybe you wanted to write this ebook but you didn't have the time. If you really wanted to do it, you could have done it but you haven't, but that's okay. Last year was difficult, astrologically speaking. This is a new, it's a new dawn. Oh my God, oh my God. Perfect timing. It's green signals to me straight away the heart chakra oh my god what does it say now is a perfect moment for you to act upon your inspiration the doors are open while you walk through them with us by your side don't delay or procrastinate as all the ingredients are ripe for your success everything and everyone is on your side supporting your positive outcome holy moly dude dude this is amazing Let's read what Doreen's got to say. Oh my God, I even opened to the right page. It says, this card means that you need to take certain steps before your prayers can be fully answered. The angels say that now is the perfect time to act. They will guide you along the way. Sometimes it's not so important how we approach a situation, but that we put energy, action, and intention into manifesting what we desire. Once we take the first step in the direction of our desired outcome, the universe then gives us additional help. So it's kind of like when you're abseiling and you need to take that first step and then you're like freaking out and you're like, oh my God, I'm gonna die over this cliff. And then as you start going down, it's like, oh, it's so much easier. The first step is always the hardest. I'm sure there's a song about that. Um, additional meanings, take action now. Oh my God. <laughs> The situation will work out well provided that you don't delay. Make a decision. Any blocks in the past were because the timing wasn't right yet. No shit, Sherlock. Holy moly. Let <sighs> me mm, do it this way so you can actually see. So these are the cards, my love. What a beautiful reading. Like, come on. Like whatever is coming to your intuition, like your, maybe it's your intuition, whatever you're channeling right now or whatever's like popping up in your head, that's what this reading is about for you. I know there's a lot that's popping up for me and this is amazing, but this is a collective reading and a general reading for our beautiful MK Love fam. Oh my gosh, my loves, thank you so much for watching. I hope you haven't enjoyed 
enjoyed this video, please make sure that you are subscribed to my channel so you never miss another episode. Also make sure you click on to the little bell button because that signals um, notifications to let you know um, when I have videos posted. My schedule has been a little bit all over the shop lately. Creativity has kind of stopped because I haven't been in alignment. Um, and I've been taking a lot of time to work on my own little projects. So I'm so excited. Please make sure that you take action now. I'm pumped. I am so pumped. This was a pleasure to do this reading for you. I wanted to say wherever you are in your journey to become your greatest version, continue to make better choices. Make that step to take action today. I wish you all the success. Post in the comment section below what is this new venture that your heart desires. Oh, I can't wait to read them and I will comment back to you as soon as I can. I love you, I love you, I love you. And I'll see you next episode, my loves. Have a good day, goodbye.